What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. This is a free general collective reading for all signs. Cups beside you, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate. Leave the rest. Free general collective reading. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess Tarot 5. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash at Mobinmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate if you choose to donate. Um, love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. I do. All right. Um, this is a bonus for June. I got a couple channel in, so I'm going to go and do yours. Um, your first thing this morning, we're going to do it. Okay. So the channel message I received was home renovations um, on stolen money are about to stop at a halt is the first message. Um, and then the second one I heard a forged POA and forged documents are about to just disappear, never to be found again. So you plug it in how it resonates. Home renovations on um, stolen money are just about to stop. So. I mean, this could be you or somebody you're connected to. But somebody's um, renovating homes on stolen money or a home on stolen money. How that resonates? But how that resonates? The heart is just about to come to a stop, like a freaking dead stop. Um, and it's not going to start up back, back. And it's not going to start back. It's not going to start back. It's about the energy is about to completely shift. The energy is about to completely shift is what I heard. So the energy is about to completely shift and it's not going to start back up. And somebody's got a forged POA, man. That's criminal. That's criminal and highly illegal and a huge no-no. A huge fucking no-no. That's like fucking prison time for anybody who doesn't know that. Just saying. Um, I heard the forged POA and forged other documents are about to just completely um, be lost and never, never be found again. So you plug that in, how that resonates. If it's not you, Libra, it could be somebody you're connected to. But somebody's got some uh, forged POA and forged other documentation of a family member. Of a family member is what I heard. So they have forged POA and forged other documentation of a family member. It could be you or somebody you're connected to that has this. And somebody's renovating homes of stolen money. Whether it's you or somebody you're connected to, I heard that's about to come to a complete stop and the energy is about to completely shift. So um, you plug that in, however that resonates and applies in one's life, Libra. It could be you or somebody you're connected to. This is a bonus for a sign of leaps. This could resonate if you have Libra in any aspect of your chart. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Thumb, and Hammer, Jupiter charts. I encourage everyone to check out their Sun, Moon, Rising, and um, uh, North Node uh, signs as well to give you better understanding um, or message or messages. These are psychic intuitive messages, so it's very important to only take the messages that resonate with the rest. We have Shark and Starfish. Someone's about to find out about the stolen money and call federal agents. Know this. It's about to create many negative series of chain events for the thief. And one of these aspects is the Libra about to do this on another Libra. Okay. Heard. Um, so it sounds like a Libra has stolen money and they're using it for uh, house flipping. House flipping. Okay. So a Libra has stolen money and they're using it for house flipping. Uh, but another Libra is about to find this out, and I heard they're about to call federal agents. So, uh, one of you guys has stolen money, and you're using it for house flipping in some shape, form, or fashion. Um, and, but another Libra is about to find this out, that you have the stolen money, Libra, and I heard they're about to call federal agents. And it's about to call, cause many, 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 many negative series of chain events for you. Many. Know this. And it's about to cause many negative series of chain events for you. Know this. So, 
the one that has stolen money and you're using it, you're, it sounds like you're using it to be a house whisper, is what it sounds like here. Um, but you shouldn't have ever had the damn stolen money to begin with. But how that resonates, um, your eyes about to get busted, basically. It's about to cause many negative series of chain of events for you. It sounds like a high vibrational Libra is about to call federal agents. Um, and it's about to cause many negative series of chain of events for you. Very messy that you have reflected. Someone is about to be stuck. A Libra, karmic Libra is about to be stuck with a lot of homes. A lot of homes no one's going to want to buy. Because th they're not supposed to have them anyways. Many negative series of chain events are about to happen for this person. Many, 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 many. Oh my God, what is up with this? Thiever Home Flipper Libra. That's the only one I'm pulling in. A Thiever Home Flipper Libra. Um, a high vibrational Libra, too. Uh, you have to plug yourself in where you fit. Um, are you high vibrational? Are you low vibrational? You treat people with honesty, trust, respect, morals, values, and integrity, and ethics. Obviously, this Libra don't. But uh, another Libra is about to find out about this low vibrational Libra. I heard they're about to call federal agents, and it's about to... Um, it's about to basically just shut the operation down. Um, and they'll be stuck with a bunch of homes that basically they're not supposed to have anyway. Spirit messages you have reflected. Dagger, Mountain. This agent is about not the best around, and they're about to get a lot of people involved in this soon and quickly. Know this for the high vibrational Libra and the low vibrational Libra. Okay, I heard this agent is about to not mess around. Know this. Um, they're about to get a lot of people involved. Um, know this for the high vibrational and the low vibrational Libra. So you have to play yourself in where you fit, Leaves. Are you the one about to call federal agents on this person? You're about because you're pulling this fraud or house flipper in in a huge ass way um whoever you are sir ma'am um but you're about to call federal agents confirmation for my bad boy so you plug it in how it resonates wow man come on buddy all right we have starfish and shark for some i strongly feel you're dealing with water signs cancer Pisces, scorpios they are, they have Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, and their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Ortho, Mid, Hammer, Jupiter charts. If you are strong, water side energy. For some, I strongly feel you're dealing with one or two plus of them. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpios. And you have Toad, Dagger, Fear, wor Worries, 10 Situations, Mountain, Major Challenges to Overcome, Starfish. A Libra is about to get high on her at, at their workplace soon. A hospital. African American Libra. About to care when nobody else is about to. About to make shit roll. 
well, you go with your bad self, Libra. So you're coming as a starfish energy. Um, like, I think, this, like the star, you're the star here. Um, you're taking on the starfish energy. You're African-American Libra and you work at a hospital. Um, I heard you're about to get high on her. Um, you're about to care when nobody else cares, basically. And uh, trust me, I've been there many times in my life working in hospitals and um, facilities, period, as an RN. Um, people, are they're very greedy working at hospitals and long-term care facilities, and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. I mean, a lot of them don't care, and that's just the damn truth. But you do care, and you're about to, I heard you're about to make it shit roll, basically. You're about to make shit roll and happen. Sounds like people don't want to make shit roll and happen, and you're about to do it. You are African American, and this is not about race, but I heard you are, and you are a um, Libra, Fib. Um, so you plug it in, how it resonates, ma'am. I feel this is like the Golden Star Award here, ma'am. You go with your badass self if this resonates for you. And a Libra nurse is about to spot a fraud, a fraud in their workplace, and they're about to report their ass. Oh, my God. And a Libra fraud is about to spot a fraud in their workplace, and they're about to report their ass. So, um, you're about to be the star energy, taking on the star energy, um, stepping up and reporting this person. I heard they're a fraud, and they're in your workplace. I feel you can work at any workplace, um, sir, ma'am. And you're about to step up and report them. Um, I think official reporting energy here is exactly what I think. But you plug it in, how it resonates. That's beautiful. Shark. A very aggressive scorpionic energy is about to come into coming back into your life soon. Very aggressive. Okay, I heard a very aggressive scorpionic energy is about to come back into your life soon. Very aggressive. Um, so you plug it in, how it resonates. So uh, some kind of aggressive scorpionic energy. I feel like be masculine or feminine. Um, they could have Scorpio in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or feminine, hammer, Jupiter, charts. But you know this person. You know this person. And they're about to come back into your life. Um, they're taking on the shark energy. Aggression. Aggression. And um, aggression, man. Rawr. Um, so you plug it in, how it resonates. This person is going to be completely different than what you remember them. This person is going to be completely different than what you remember them. Is what I heard. This person is going to be completely different than what you remember them. So, um, they're, they're going to, I'm assuming they were not aggressive when you knew them in the past, but it sounds like they're coming up in your energetic space is becoming aggressive. So, whoever this person is. For Summons of Pisces. For Summons of Pisces. Summons of Pisces. Summons of, um, um, Scorpio, you plug it in, how it resonates. Through many series of chain events, a Libra criminal feminine will be in handcuffs very soon. Through many series of chain events, a Libra criminal handcuff, a Libra fem criminal will be in handcuffs soon. So, um, you plug it in, how it resonates. Wow, man. About to apprehend a criminal. Might be that illegal house flipper on stolen money or somebody else. One of you guys is about to help put her there, I think. Uh, I'm serious. I think one of you guys is about to help put her there. Um, but some kind of aggressive, scorpionic, and Piscean energy from your past. Of course, you only take the messages that resonate, leave the rest. These are psychic, intuitive messages. Um, but 
yeah, um, they. I don't think they were, for some, they could have been aggressive in the past. For some, maybe not. I don't know. But it could be a mask on a fin Pisces, mask on a fin Scorps. They could have Pisces or Scorps in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, and Midham, or Jupiter charts. But however that resonates, um, they are coming in as a shark energy, aggressive now for some reason. Now, I'm not sure why. Um, only you will know why, not anybody else. It's about money and about the past. It's about money and it's about the past. And one of these people will end up in rehab soon. It's about money, it's about the past, and one of these people will end up in rehab soon. So rehabilitation, um, maybe it's for drugs, maybe it's for alcohol, maybe it's for some other kind of addiction, but... You plug it in, how it resonates. I don't feel this is physical rehabilitation. I feel it's got some kind of mental health rehabilitation. And I'm just being for real. Um, how that resonates. But I heard uh, one of them will end up in rehabil rehabilitation soon. So um, you plug it in, how it resonates. Code. A karmic air sign to you is about to reveal information. For some, they're about to betray you. They should have never betrayed you. For some, they're about to betray you because you're a criminal. Oh, my God. I heard a karmic air sign is about... um. Some of you guys, they're about to betray you. I heard you don't deserve to be betrayed, basically. So, you're not a karmic, but they're a karmic to you. For some, you are a criminal, so you deserve to be betrayed. Um, and that's why they're taking on the karmic energy to you. But in all fairness, if you're a criminal, you deserve to be betrayed. I don't care what sign you are, who you are, or what have you. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates, but they're taking on the karmic energy to you, the code energy, the karmic energy to you, because you are a damn criminal. For one, for one. Now, I just might, might be for one. For, one, for the rest of you guys, you're not a criminal. And they're just betraying you just because they want to betray you. Um, which is shitty. So, um, it's a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius energy. Um, masculine. Masculine. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, masculine. They could have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and their sun, moon, rising. Venus, North, they've been having a Jupiter charts, if that resonates for you. For some, it's a feminine. For some, it's a fem. Okay, so, so Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, masculine, or fem. They could have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and their sun, moon, rising. Venus, North, they've been having a Jupiter charts, masculine, or feminine. Um, air sign. Um, but, for some, you don't deserve to be betrayed, in all fairness. You don't deserve to be betrayed, and I'm so sorry. For some, you do. You plug it in. I don't know. Well, because you're a criminal. Because you're a criminal. So, you plug it in how it resonates. So, code energy, karmic energy. A huge creative block for a very karmic Libra. A huge creative block for a very karmic Libra is what I heard. So a huge creative block coming for a very karmic Libra. And a huge creative burst for a very high vibrational Libra. And a huge creative burst for a very high vibrational Libra. So I feel that's this. So karmic block, um, creative block energy for a karmic Libra and creative burst energy for a very creative Libra. So you have to plug yourself in in a situation and story however that resonates and applies for you. Um... Let me see if I hear anything about the betrayals for the ones that don't deserve it. The high vibrational ones in here. You have to plug yourself in where you fit. Cheating. Cheating. That's what I heard. Cheating. So one of you guys is about to get cheated on. Um, I heard you don't deserve it. And I'm so sorry. Um, and I feel it's air sign about to do this. A masculine or feminine air sign. 
Gemini, Libra, Aquarius about to do this. I am so sorry for whoever that's for. Nobody deserves that shit. People should just be straight up. Um, if they want to break up, break up. You don't want to break up, don't break up. Work on it, but don't fucking cheat. And I'm just being for real. Um, this is sad. I'm so sorry. So um, I really am for whoever that's for. The ones ones that don't deserve it. But one of you guys, you're a criminal. Um, you're about to be exposed. And honestly, I don't feel sorry for you if that resonates for you. Someone's about to go into the military. A Libra is about to go into the military, and a Libra is about to start school soon. A Libra is about to uh, go into the military, and a Libra is about to start school soon. So, well, that's beautiful. Well, that's not toad energy. Um, maybe you were a karmic in the past, and you changed your ways, possibly. Uh, but one of you guys is about to go into the military soon. I heard a one you're about to go. Um, you're about to start school. So maybe you got a Pell Grant, maybe you're saving up money for school, maybe you are a trust fund baby, I'm not sure, but somehow you're able to go to school, maybe you work four jobs. Everybody's life situation and story is different, so you have to plug it in how it resonates. Um, and one, you are um, going into military, it sounds like it's you about to do this. So you plug it in how it resonates, you guys, that's beautiful. Alright, let's get you a song. I, I mean, I gotta pee, I wasn't even planning on doing this one, but I got a channel message, so... A low vibrational Libra that was secretly competing, it's about to blow up in their face in a huge way. But a but a Libra that is not secretly competed with anybody is about to go very, very well for you. Know this. Okay, I heard a low vibrational Libra that has been secretly competing with someone else is about to blow up in their face in a huge way. But a Libra that has... Um, but a Libra that has not been secretly competing, and it sounds like doing it on even playing field, it's about to go very well for them. So you have to plug yourself in where you fit. Are you low vibrational? Are you high vibrational? Um, have you been on equal playing field, or have you been doing it dirty behind the scenes? Are the one that's been doing it the right way, it's about to go very well for you. It might be an actual competition, um, or a race, or something of that nature, or maybe it's just equal... Um, Competition practices, how that resonates in one's life. But it's going to go well for you, but somebody's been doing it very dirty behind the scenes. It's about to blow up on them, like backfire. So you plug it in, how it resonates. Let me get a song. A Taurus that was once a very positive influence in a Libra's life, it's about to become very opposite. Know this, very opposite. A Taurus that was once a very positive influence in a Libra's life, I heard that they're about to become very opposite. You plug it in, how it resonates. For one of you Libras, they're a very immature masculine Taurus. He works at a hospital. Okay, for one of you guys, um, he's a very immature Taurus and he uh, works at a hospital. Um, it sounds like you're, it sounds like he annoys the hell out of you, is what it sounds like. It sounds like he annoys the hell out of you, um, and, um, uh, that's why the relationship's about to change for one of you guys. Um, for one, um, it's any other kind of way, how that resonates, okay? But heavy torn energy, they have Taurus in their Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, or Feminine, Ham, and Jupiter charts. Whether it's this very immature masculine uh, Taurus that works in a hospital, and he's very, I mean, it's not because he's um, young, it's just because he mentally is young, and it sounds like he annoys the living fuck out of you, um, and honestly, he'd probably annoy the, he would probably annoy the living hell out of me too, and that's just the damn truth, um, but um, how about that resonates, or some, some other Taurus. For some, it's a secret lover. 
for some it's a secret lover. For some, it's a family member. For some, it's a family member. So for some, it's a secret lover. So some, it's a family member. For some, it's this very annoying, younger, immature, masculine force that works at a damn hospital. Um, however you interact with this person, you plug it in, how it resonates. Dagger, fear, worries, tense situations. Okay, the song is I Stand Alone by Godsmack. So I feel some of you guys, you feel yourself very um, independent, um, independent people, and you um, you love to um, create and stand alone, and um, you love to um, be your own self. You don't like to be sneakily, creepily voyeured with fucking hidden cameras and have your energy suck um, till five days of the week. Um, you like to have your own space, your own freedom, your own creative ideas and thoughts, and you love to create uh, whatever it is you create and do and stand alone in. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. A masculine li uh, Libra, high vibrational Libra, is about to help out a thin Leo. They never thought they would, but they're about to. Masculine high vibrational Libra is about to help out a feminine Leo. They never thought they would, but they are about to. So you plug yourself in, sir, wherever you resonate. Um, you, you're high vibrational Libra, so you treat people with honesty, trust, respect, respect morals, values, and integrity. Um, I heard you're about to help out a fem Leo. You never thought you would, but you're about to. So uh, whoever this fem Leo is in your life and however they resonate, they could have Leo in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or feminine, have your Jupiter chart. So that resonates for you, sir. Um, and you are a high vibrational Libra masculine so you could have leaves in your sun moon rising venus fourth and Jupiter you for charge you treat people honestly trust respect morals values ethics and integrity ethics i want to reiterate that so you're not a toad you're not a karmic this dim leo or at least you're not now you might have been in the past but you're not now but this resonates so you plug it in how it resonates fear worries tense situations A cancer is about to have a very unexpected run-in. A Libra is about to have a very unexpected run-in with cancer. Very unexpected run-in. A Libra is about to have a very unexpected run-in with a cancer. Very unexpected run-in. So um, you plug that in, how that resonates there, um, Libra. So I think... Um, the cancer is going to be fear, uh, fearful, have worries, and some kind of tense situation or situations. Or um, I think it's the cancer um, about to have this. I think they're going to be stressed. They're going to be worried. They're going to be probably wanting to tell you everything that's on their mind. Um, I don't think it's you. I don't think it's you. Um, I think it's this cancer. They could have cancer on their sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, moon, and Jupiter charts. I think it's, it's definitely somebody you know if this resonates for you. You plug it in, how it resonates. And a Pisces is about to make a phone call. They never thought they were going to know this. And a Pisces is about to make a phone call. They never thought they were going to know this. And a Pisces is about to make a phone call. They never thought they were going to know this. So maybe it's going to make you fear, fearful, worried, or have some kind of tense situations possibly with this Pisces. Um, to me, it could go positive or negative with this Piscean. But I'll tell you, this Piscean is about to make a phone call. They never thought they were going to. It, they could be scared, worried, or have tense situations, or you could be scared or worried about this phone call that this Pisces never thought they were going to make. How that resonates there, um, Libra? Mountain, major challenges to overcome. Houses are about to just come empty. Come empty. Stop work. A huge ass scam is about to come to a complete halt soon houses are about to stop work refusal to work i heard refusal to work wow a huge ass scam is about to come to a complete halt somebody's got some kind of house flipping um, scam um a libra does and i'm just being for real a libra has a house flipping scam one of you guys is about to find out about it one i think you already know and you're about to report this shit um, I don't know if you're going to report it to police or feds or 
um, somebody else, but somebody is about to report this. It's a, it sounds like a large house flipping scam. Um, they shouldn't have even had the money to begin with, but they do have it and they're flipping all these homes and it sounds like contracting all these people out and, and having other people in on the scam and fraudulent money used in these homes. But it's about to stop. I heard it's about to stop. It's about to come to a complete stop. Halt. Come to a complete stop halt. So it's about to come to a complete stop and a halt. Um, and um, now I feel you could be a high vibrational Libra about to expose this. Some, one of you guys is about to expose it, but one of you guys is involved in this shit. And that's just the truth. And that could be the fear, worries, and tense situations too. Um, but it sounds like they have involved all these contractors and all these people to come out and basically be involved with the fraudulent money and scam, but it's about to stop. It's about to stop. So that could be made. Um, kudos to the kudos to the one about to help stop it. I just want to let you know, high vibrational person or people, especially that high vibrational masculine energy um, that's about to help. Kudos to the one about to stop it. And I'm just being for real. We need more people like you in this life. Major challenge to over, challenges to overcome. And someone's about to expose money laundering soon. For one a Libra. One on a Libra. And someone's about to expose money laundering soon. One on a Libra. One, it is a Libra about to expose it. So, one of you guys knows about money laundering. You're about to expose it. One, I feel you're involved in money laundering. So, that could be the major challenges to overcome as well. You plug it in how it resonates. In a book that has been written on a computer drive, it's about to completely get erased. Know this. Hat, but it's about to disappear. All of it. Oh my God, whoa, and a computer that was written on a hard drive sounds like it's currently on a hard drive. It sounds like it hasn't went into the publish, publisher, I can't speak, publisher yet. Um, or maybe it has. I don't feel it has. I feel it's still in the writing process. But how that resonates, um, it is a book that um, it sounds like in the process of being writing, uh, being written. But how that resonates, um, I heard it's just about to completely disappear. It's about to completely disappear, period, point blank, Neil, boom. Um, and, um, never, never to be, um, refurbished again, refurbished or, um, found or what have you, what have you. Um, I heard hackers, so some kind of hackers is about to hack it. That's what it sounds like. Um, how that resonates? It is about to completely disappear. Completely disappear. And I heard never to be found again, so. You plug it in how it resonates, and that could be the major challenges to overcome. Maybe you're writing this book, or somebody you're connected to is writing this book, but somebody's writing this book. Um, but it's about to, some kind of hacker energy is about to completely make it disappear. Um, it's never going to be found again. Major challenges to overcome. And a federal agent connecting with a feminine energy is about to become very significant. And a Libra is about to reconnect with a federal agent of her past heavy sexual relations, but it's not going to be that way this time. It's going to be completely opposite. Know this. Completely. Completely, completely. Okay, so one of you guys is about to connect with federal agents soon. Um, I heard, um, it sounds like, it's going to go very well for you. Know this. High vibrational Libra. And a Libra is about to connect with federal agents soon. It's going to go very, very, very well for you. So, um, you're a high vibrational Libra. You're about to connect with federal agents. Heavy federal agent energy in here. I heard it's going to go very well for you. So whoever that's for, that's good. 
Major challenges to overcome. It sounds like this is something you need to report to a federal agency. It could be about money laundering. It could be this illegal house flipping scam shit. It could be something else. Um, but whatever it is, you're about to report it. Whatever it is. Kudos to you, ma'am or sir. Another one of you guys, I heard you have had a connection with a federal agent in the past. Very sexual connection. But I heard it's this time when you reconnect with this federal agent, it's about, it's about to be completely different. Like, completely different. So you plug it in how it resonates. So major challenges to overcome is um, that. You plug it in how it resonates. A Libra that once got no respect in the past are about to get lots of respect. And a Libra that got lots of respect in the past from bullying and harassment, their ass is about to be caught in a huge way. Wow, this is beautiful. This is like yin and yang. I'm really loving this reading. You have to plug yourself in where you fit. Are you the high vibrational one? Are you the low vibrational one? Are you the criminal and the crook and the house flipper scammer or the money launderer or blase, blase, blase or a criminal or are you not? And that's just the truth. Uh, but whoever you are, um, one of you guys got no respect in the past, basically. Like, no respect, nil to none. But you're about to get lots of respect soon. I think you're about to do the right thing on person, people, place, family, or situation. But one, I heard they got respect in the past from bullying and harassment. So they bullied and harassed people, um, basically, for respect. That's, that's not real respect. That's like Hitler domineering energy, just to let everybody know. Hi, Hitler. No, no, no. Nay, fucking nay. That's just damn true. Um, so, whoever this person is, um, high fucking Hitler person over here, or wannabe high fucking Hitler person, um, they're about to be exposed. Many, 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 many negative series of chain events are about to happen for them. Many. Soon and quickly. Many negative series of chain events are about to happen for them soon and quickly. So, their life is about to go down. But they got their respect from um, from domineering and controlling people, basically. Domineering and controlling people. Um, and that's just the truth. You shouldn't gain your respect from domineering and controlling people. You should gain your respect because you're a good person. And you truly do treat people with honesty, trust, respect, morals, values, ethics, and integrity. Like this person that got no respect in the past, but they're about to get respect. So they're about to do the right thing. They're about to transmute the energy. Libra, high vibrational Libra over here. Whoever you are, sir, ma'am. You're about to transmute the energy in a positive way, sir, ma'am. To benefit you and to benefit others, I'm feeling. Um, I think you're about to do the right thing in something. Um, I don't feel you did in the past, but you're about to now. Um, and you're about to change your life. And I think you're about to help put away a criminal of criminals. In one of these situations. I'm just being damn serious. Um, so the major challenges to overcome in this situation was you never got any respect in the past. But in all fairness, you're about to earn your respect. And that's beautiful. That's really beautiful. This is really is a pretty good reading, you guys. Let me see if I can get a song. Oh, I did. I stand alone. That's right. An Aries is about to be pissed off at a Libra. Low vibrational Aries, low vibrational Libra. Okay, I heard a low vibrational Aries is about to be pissed off at a Libra. And know that refunded money, returned money that should have been returned all along is about to be returned to a feminine energy through many series of shame events. A low vibrational Aries is very pissed at a low vibrational Libra. So, you know, if you're not in that category, you're not in that category. Low vibrational Aries is about to be very pissed off or is pissed off, how that resonates. At a low vibrational Libra, they could have Aries or Libra in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or Thumb, and Hammer, Jupiter charts, heavy Aries energy. And a, um, a them energy, it could be a Libra or another sign uh, that should have had money returned to them all along. I heard through many series of chain events, it's about to be returned to them. Um, so you plug it in how it resonates. The scales are about to be balanced in a true Libran fashion. The scales are about to be balanced in a true Libran fashion. I love a Libra energy when people are upright, and that's just the truth. Not these low vibrational house the uh, frauders and scammers and thieves and flippers. I would love to have house flip. 
y'all know me for years. I've been fucking loving the house flip. I just got to, um, I want to make sure I have enough investment before I do it. Um, that's my thing. But once I do, buddy, I'm getting out there. And that's just the truth. Um, but I'm going to do it the right way. I'm going to do it the right way, man. Uh, whoever has stolen money to do this shit, that's really shitty. And that's just the truth. But their mouse is about to be exposed. Flip flops. Toes in the sand. Flip flops and toes in the sand is what I heard. Flip flops and toes in the sand. Well, that's beautiful. So, yeah, you, you guys, I hope you enjoyed this. If you think anyone else would like a channel, please feel free to uh, share my channel very publicly, social media, word of mouth. I very much appreciate it. And a story is about to go viral very soon, very quickly. Know this. One, you're about to help it get it, get it there. One, you are involved in a negative way. And a story is about to go very viral very soon. Uh, one, you're about to help get it there. So you're about to help the story go very viral very soon. So you're about to be a catalyst in a positive way to get the story out very I heard soon and viral. So um, kudos to you, sir, ma'am, about to do this. Um, it could be your story or somebody else's story, how that resonates. Um, and um, But for one, you're involved in the story in a negative way. So you have to place yourself in where you fit. Okay. All right. We're done. I'm getting out of this. Hope you enjoyed your bonus and namaste.